Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I wanted to show you guys how I made this super cute and super easy construction number cake. So if you're interested in seeing how I made it, then please keep on watching this video and don't forget to subscribe for more. Let's get started. So to start off, I'm making my chocolate icing. This is fudge icing from Krusty's. I got this box of icing at Smart Food Service and I'm just measuring out half the package and following directions, adding hot water and then putting it on my mixer and letting that mix up. You know I'm gonna make my filling. This is just chopped strawberries, one container's worth and one full container of Cool Whip. And then I'm adding um, about a third of the tube of pre-made strawberry filling. Um, this is another way to make my most popular cake filling. Uh, I have a video coming out about how to make these fillings soon, so keep a lookout for that. And now I'm preparing my chocolate cakes. I baked two eight inch cakes and I'm just um, cutting them in half so that I can get two layers out of each cake. Uh, and then I'm putting my two eight inch cakes on my half sheet board and using a circle cutter to cut out the centers. And then uh, using a knife, I'm gonna cut out a couple other little pieces um, I will link the video that I used to learn how to cut this cake in the description box if you guys want to see how they did it. Um, that one's like a time lapse video, but it's a lot clearer uh, how they cut the cake there. So anyways, <laughs> cleaning off the board. This is a pretty crummy chocolate cake, so um, I used butter in it instead of the normal oil in the recipe to hopefully make it a little bit better for carving. But yeah, I did a dam around the outside of the cake and I'm putting a lot of this filling in. What's really great about this filling is that it's really firm and stiff and so you can pile it up high. So now I'm doing a crumb coat around the outside. Um, I just, at this point I decided I was gonna put, um, use the leftover cake around the outside to put, um, make it look like dirt, I guess. So I didn't wasn't worrying too much about the sides of the cake. Um, however, the top of the cake will be exposed, so that part is like, I guess, a final coat. But, yeah, here I am putting on the chocolate crumbs. This is just, like I said, some of the other cake that I cut off. I just crumbled it in a bowl, and I'm pressing that along the sides of the cake. By the way, I know some of you guys will ask me, this frosting is delicious. I highly recommend it if you can get your hands on it. It's super delicious. I like that it doesn't take up a lot of room in my pantry and I have it whenever I need chocolate frosting. Okay, here I have some pre-colored green buttercream. This is buttercream that I colored for a previous cake that I made. Um, and I keep it in the freezer and all I did was take it out, let it come to room temperature and then use a grass tip to pipe around the outside of the cake. I'm also using some more chocolate frosting to make little mounds of dirt all over the cake. And then uh, putting on these little tractor construction car set that I found on Amazon. I will link it in the description box if you're interested. And then uh, something that I didn't show in this video, but is I ended up going and putting on some edible rocks, some edible chocolate rocks and some edible sugar crystals on the cake. I also made those little signs, the little construction cone and the kids at work sign. Um, I found those on Google and I just put the, imported them into my Cricut design space and cut them out with my Cricut. Um, and then I just glued on a, a toothpick to it and stuck it in the cake. So my client was super happy with this cake and she said it was so delicious. So if you guys want to try this cake out, I really hope you guys do and tag me on your pictures on Instagram. My Instagram is in the description box down below. And if you want to see more of my cake decorating videos, then please, please, please subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.